donated dollar, it's saving a child's life. And it's helping kids like Molly, who are such inspirations to all of us. Well, we're here in Grand Central today to celebrate our CMN fundraising that we did here in Division 4 in New York. We raised over $348,000 for the uh, children. Uh, it's a great event. We have Miss America here to celebrate it with us, along with some CMN officials and uh, one of our CMN children, Molly. One of the things that I do throughout my year is serve as the National Goodwill Ambassador for Children's Miracle Network Hospitals. So I am firsthand involved in the fundraisers, visiting the hospitals, spending time with the children. I have leukemia, ALS leukemia, I think, and um, it was like every day I had to wake up, I had to get an IV every day, it was difficult. They had to like get a needle every day and it was like, it was hard. We thought uh, the worst and God willing and with the capable people and doctors, Molly came through with okay and a lot of children are coming through with okay because of uh, the generosity of the public helping them and we're very, very grateful. Until you're in a hospital room um, with someone who's been in a car crash or who has cancer or something horrible going on in their family there and, and they say, you know, you might not know it, but you really, really brightened his day or you really, really made a difference in his day. Those are the things that make me want to continue doing this and that make me have such a heart for it. I have a nephew. He's 16. He has no language. He's not potty trained. He has tuberous sclerosis and he's severely autistic. And he goes to the Children's Hospital in my community all the time. And he's able to be alive today thanks to each one of these associates and the amazing work that they do. So from the bottom of my heart, I cannot thank them enough for their support. The team really, really was enthusiastic at an all-time uh, all high this year with enthusiasm and passion. Special events, you know, uh, stores did petting zoos, uh, dancing, ballroom dancing marathons, volleyball tournaments, a lot of out of the box. But again, the biggest thing is what they did in the stores by asking every customer on every transaction if they like to donate to CMN, and uh, they just did a fabulous job. And I want to kind of like have a bet, and if we hit the 15,000 mark, I was going to shave my head. And everybody rally, everybody do phenomenal, and we raised, I think it was 15.3. He shaved his head in the back of the store, and um, we used the barber shears first, and we buzzed it down, we gave him a mohawk, so we had a little fun with him, and then we took a, like, a Bic razor and then shaved it completely bald, so it was good for everyone, we were all laughing, taking videos and pictures. There is not one child or family that's denied from Children's Hospital, so these fundraisers truly are what fund these hospitals and what keep these hospitals going. So just a huge thank you and to keep it up. Every time you ask a customer if they want to donate a dollar to their local Children's Hospital, you are helping save a child's life. And for that, I say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. With all this money and donations, it really, really, really does help people.